Pizza by default is a communal meal. We want this to be a very warm hearth type restaurant where people just feel like they are at home. Home is where your family is, right? And it, it truly does feel like home. Knowing how many people count on you to keep the ship going, that's something that I hadn't really faced before. People really rely on you as a small business owner. All your employees, your, your purveyors, they relied on you. And it was, it was a burden, but it's, it's pretty cool to know that like, the work that you do affects that many people. Something that we prioritize greatly is we haven't laid a single person off. As a rule, <laughs> we'll figure out a different way. We always had a dream of having multiple locations. We didn't want the pandemic to slow us down or crush our dreams. It was uncertain what the future of Dine-In was even going to look like. We decided we could get creative. And that's where Charlotte came from. That's our zero seat retail and pizza takeout focused location. And that really, that was a good choice. It really helped us weather the storm. When we opened up our third location in Charlotte in the midst of the pandemic, it was, I think we can keep doing this. I think we can hire more people. I think we can, you know, broaden the scope of what we do and have a little more fun. And it's worked out beautifully. I guess that's kind of our style. <laughs> Yeah. taking some risks and it usually works out pretty well. It's all about the communication. Between the three of us, we, we each represent parts of the business and it's when we can all get together, talk, come up with ideas. That's where the, the secret sauce is. I think for a number of reasons, we survived much better than some of our brethren throughout the industry. Did we take a sales hit? Yes. but. We were still able to keep the majority of our sales going. We learn more, we get to be stronger business owners as we move along throughout all the challenges. If there was one thing that has kind of contributed to our success, it's, it's just trying to be good business owners. Yeah. Just trying to operate with integrity. We hope that people see that. We hope that people feel that when they enter our location. I can't imagine a life without Stone's Throw.